Matthew 10 36. Can we read it together? One, two, three, go. And the man's souls shall be they of his own house. Lord, help us and prove yourself in Jesus' name. Now sit down. That scripture simply means that the enemy of a man's or enemy of a man is from his own house. Now there is something the Lord put strongly in my heart and I want us to walk in agreement this morning. There are two things I want to deal with in this service. You watching me there. I want you to make sure you connect your spirit, soul, and body. Because the Lord opened my eyes, show me another type of wickedness, which is real. I will explain to you, and I believe you will understand it. We are dealing against the wickedness of the wicked. I don't know in any form they have been following you, but I believe by the mercy of heaven, you get free from their hand. If you are putting them in, say if you agree with it. Now, he said, the enemy of a man is from his own house. It sounds strange. Jesus was the one talking. He said, man's soul is from those of his own house. He's not an outsider. The majority of our battle that, that is challenging many of us is from our family. And that's why he said that many of us, we are all not outside. But if you go to our own house, they don't call us anybody. Because they say, prophet is never honored. Why? Because they are, your, they are enemies of your destiny. So they can't honor you. Others will honor you. They will look at you and tell you, say, just like this. What is too special about you? That is it. Now, this morning, I want to talk about household wickedness. Or, you can still call it unfriendly friend. I want to combine the two of them. Now, what is the difference? Household enemy are the enemies from your father's house who pretend they are your brothers and sisters, but they are the problem of your life. But unfriendly friend is someone you call a friend. You eat with him, but he's ready to betray you like Judas. Now, do you know there are enemies that no matter how you bless them, they must betray you. There's a scripture, there's something I saw in John chapter 12, I think verse 4. Let's look at it. John 12 verse 4. He said, he said then said one of his disciples, what was his name? Judas Iscariot, Simon's son. Now why was he there? Which should betray him? Finish. That was his mission. Others were there to serve the master. Others were there to bless him. But he was there to do what? To betray. When I read this scripture and God asked me, he said, do you know that today there are people you carry, there are people that follow you, even you as a man, as a businessman, you have been spending your money with them, for them, but yet their mission is to betray. Nothing more than that. But look at my prayer for you. I didn't say they would change their mind. But look at my prayer for you. No matter how they carry it out, they will pay with their life. Amen. Now remember, Judas sold Jesus, but he could not eat the money. And to, number two, he died before the man he sold. Read your Bible. Judas died before Jesus. He went to commit suicide. Stretch your hand toward this altar. Any man or woman around you who is like Judas, may they die in a horror. Family enemy acting like Judas. They are eating with you, but they are planning evil with you. They call you brother, they call you sister, but they are the brain behind your problem. Somebody roll fire three times. Fire, fire, fire. Now I stand on this altar, you watching me. Whoever in that house where you come from, that is signaling enemy outside, that is out to spoil you, that is out to make you cry. I decree on this altar. They will cry their cry. They will cry their cry. Whatever they wish you, they will pay for it. If I hear amen, I know you are there. Amen. Bible says, He that reward evil for good. He said, Evil will not finish in their house. Anybody around you, now watch this. 
Most times, enemies within your family, many of them, I want to show you because the first one will connect us to the second one. Many times they are fighting you not to become. Many of you, you, are, you make money in that family, they are not happy. And the first thing they did was like to stop you or to stop your entire family, but they didn't know how you managed to come up. And now let me tell you, Rema, hear me. Do you know there are some people in this life, do you know they affect them? Talk to me. If they do, you do for them. Your money will finish. You didn't hear me. I'm telling you, the grace covering them is too much. That even native daughter, when you call their name, they will tell you, say, leave that one. No be, no be normal human being. Stretch your hand, I decree. May God make you stronger than your pursuer. If they ever call your name, their name will show up. If they set you up, they will pray with their head. Let me hear a roar of fire. See that many of them never believe you can become something. But suddenly, when the Lord turned again the captivity of Zion, you will not see them. They begin, they will change the activity. But hear this. Their first activity is to stop. The Bible said the devil coming not to steal, to kill, and to destroy. John chapter 10 verse 10. But Jesus said, I came that they have life. And that's why they cannot stop you. you. Hear me? In every family, there are people that are like Moses. You don't do juju. They are like Elijah. If you they do charm for them, now you go, they die. Oh, you didn't hear me? In that market, if they call you, they will be going down. You'll be going up. You didn't hear me? They carry your name, go juju. <laughs> they will return with shame. Why? Because there's no trace of idol in your life. Devil don't know you. Now those who don't patronize devil, I know. But to you, <laughs> stretch your right hand, shout it, Father! Every trace of battle from my father's house that is against my star, in the name of Jesus, break! Stretch your hand towards me. I join them with you. If they call you, they will not get you. Please, if you are saying that, amen, let it be in agreement. Whatever they vow against you, may you be their traffic. May you be their imagination. If they succeed over order, they will not succeed you. Now sit down. Now watch this. When you come from such families and there are enemies who are there, who have sold others, who have stopped others, and they try to stop you, and they couldn't stop you, you succeed. They will migrate to another level of wickedness. I want to show you. What is the next? They have tried this woman. He couldn't stop him, her from giving birth. She born. They stopped this man not to succeed. He was excelling. They say, no, go build. The build finish. People who are pursuing, they are down. They are not that level they will enter. They will enter blackmail level. You didn't hear me. That's where they begin to tell people, say, you are a courting man. Hey, you, know, you didn't know. When men pursue, they don't catch you. They will call you as a witch. Because the way they kill others, they can't kill you. Ah! I'm telling you true. They will want to use their mouth because their juju no work. But hear me, if their juju did not work, their voice will not work. Are you hearing what I'm saying? For he disappointed the devices of the crafty so that their evil hand cannot perform their enterprise. It's not of him that runneth to will it, but of the law that showeth mercy. Hear me, you who is hearing me. In any form, they will follow. They will fail. Amen. Can I hear your amen like thunder? Amen. Now, what I'm telling you is another wickedness. There are some things. Hear me. Most of here, they say this man is this. This I don't believe it until God revealed to me. Be, because those people who never wanted to succeed, if they try you by charm of many things and you didn't go down, they will use their mouth. Money, especially when they come from your own family. Talk to me. Mighty God, hello beyond them. Faithful God, you are worthy to receive all the praise for you alone. You are the song that I sing at the mention of your name. 
every knee must bow. They will bow. Mighty God, hallow be your name. Faithful God, you are worthy to receive all the praise. For you alone, you are the song that I sing. At the mention of your name, every new must bow. Unchangeable, unchangeable God, reliable, reliable God. Only you can do what no man can do. Unchangeable, reliable, only you can do. What no man can do. Now let me ask you a question. Have you not seen it on the planet Earth? Where a man is alive and they are carrying rumor that the man is dead. Who talk up? The people who want him out of the room. And maybe they are trying to kill him. You know, greed die. They want to use mouth. I'm telling you, this is another level of wickedness. Black male. False accusation. And, and most times, if care is not taken, they want to confuse your helpers so that they can frustrate you. Do you know, I heard something some time ago. A man came out in a particular place, saw his poster, bearing obituary. I'm telling you the truth. Saw his own poster. The quote is age. How he, he died. He was looking at himself. Am I dreaming? And he brought it and showed some people they say, like, Who did this? Nobody knew. That person had tried every means. He couldn't succeed. But hear me. If they want you dead, you bury all of them. Please, that your amen. Let it agree with me. This is where you see some people who succeeded by the mercy of heaven. But because they never expect you to touch money, they will tell you you are a ritualist. Now let me tell you, I, I don't know whether you have seen it before. We are enemies who pay some people to be a false witness against some people. Oh, you never hear me. You'll be looking at yourself and say, where did we meet? I'm telling you, it's another level of wickedness. And if care is not taken, people around you believe, say your hand is not clean. Because they are there. They believe, say, even though you make the money, even though you succeed, but you'll not be happy in your life. And there are some people today as I'm talking, God has helped them. But the joy is no more there. Because the stories they are hearing around them, who forged it, they didn't know. Enemy. Are you hearing what I'm saying? I say, give up a pangwere, be kole no manya. Give up my mango because you pull me. Whoever that is on an assignment, on evil mission, who vow that no matter how he will get you down, I put my knee on the ground. May they kill yourself. In the name of Jesus, they will kill yourself. I told you in this house that I went to a city. I entered a shopping mall to get something. And the way I, I talked to the person who was selling for me, he asked me, are you a pastor? For me to answer yes, another man came out and said, oh, pastor. I said, you are calling me, but he said, I heard you telling that young man, you're a pastor. I never knew he's the owner of the place. When I was about to leave, he said, please, where are you staying? I need to talk to you. My spirit agreed to talk to you. He said, it's not what to talk here. I didn't have to give him my number. Give him my address. Later in the evening, when he finished market, he came with his wife. He said, Pastor, I don't know you. I don't easily run follow Pastor. He said, but I just saw him in my spirit. He said, I should open up to you. He said, God has blessed me, but I'm dying gradually. It was December time. He said, God has helped me to liberate my family and I'm doing my best. 
but what I'm seeing now is like the blessing does no longer give me joy. He told me, he said, you see that shopping mall from up to down, both those people who are on tenant, because he was using the whole ground floor. He said, he said, this is my property. He said, in this city, I have it like this up to three places. He told me one of the major well, electronics company. He says they are major distributor covering the, about how many states. He told me there so many things he put on, even in two furnitures. He's a distributor. God has helped him. He told me that he, look at this December now. I suppose to go Christmas. And their village is not far from that city. It's from the same state. He said, but I won't go. Because the happiness is no more there. He said, you know, I said, okay, what is the problem? Beat to the point. He said, God has blessed me, but the joy is no more there because of what I'm seeing. He said, people said he have exchanged his first daughter for money. He said, because the first daughter, after some little while, there was delay of childbirth, and the wife gave birth to that child, which he was happy, got up friends, they celebrated without knowing that the enemy had spoiled the child. But the next day, he had to bring the, the girl about five years. I'll be three or four years, sorry. That girl, he can't stay in one place. He behaves strange. He said, all the rumor is hearing. Who is talking? I don't know. They say, a court, which he joined. He said, I use this girl to exchange wealth. He said, look at the statement the man made. I lie not. He said, if not to take God, make it take the whole world. Restore this girl. He said, I'll be happy. And he was sharing tears. He said he built a big house in the village which he wanted to use as a family house. He said he completed it in that way. He furnished it. And the mother was aware that they wanted to open it. As if he needed that house in a hurry. They said, hey, we know. What did happen to his first daughter? Hey, money, they, he said, they said that one is inside the house. They vomit money. If you do like this, ah, money going to come out. Let me talk. To, I, want to, I, want to, I want to wake up something in this one. We are in the end, in the, in the season of wicked, a different time. He said, Pastor, check me. In my hands, boy, look me. Pray for me. Let God judge me. I saw God easy. He, was, he said, check. If you don't know me. If there is anything I am hiding, let God judge me. He said, the whole community. He said, hey, don't build in a baby house. In all the whole city, don't buy them. Or everywhere, houses. Because small picking the inside house. Where they vomit money. <laughs> He brought that child. He said, pray, even if not God, to take the whole of this world and it's on this stair. He said, I'll be more fulfilled. He said, okay, that house I did now, I regret of building that house. He said, if I have no, I would have even, he said, but they would still look at it that I have built all over the whole city and I didn't build in the village. He said, everywhere. He had even one of his close person told him, say, that he was, even, who came and told him, and said, he was even rebuking some people where they were talking, where they were in a family, a village meeting. They said, we don't know. But who bring out this story? Ibo papa ngwele biko le no manya Ibo mama mo bika chopola mo Because these are people who never expected it to come up. And now they couldn't stop you. They want to poke sand inside that garden. Stretch your hand. Any one of you under the sound of my voice, they are carrying wrong rumor. Bearing with them of what is naughty. May your God answer them in a hurry. In the name of Jesus, may your God answer them in a hurry. And I talk to, talk to you there, as a man of God there, see vision that is real, that have evidence. I'm telling you at times, that's why it says at times some people are even scared of church. Because at times some church have scattered some home without evidence. Talk to me. That's the truth. Don't you, you know what, what I'm saying? Some marriages have scattered because of one pastor somewhere. I didn't say there are no cultural people. They are there. But pray, let God expose them because the wicked cannot go unpunished. But don't be a witness of what you don't know. There was a man one day who came to me here. Somebody directed him to me. He was sharing tears. He was talking to me, crying. This is a man who God has blessed. 
There are things you hear at times, you go be like, say, make I not even pray, may God bless me at all. If God bless you, wahala. He not give you problem. Because if you don't get, you still get problem. No, the man came to me and said, he said, Pastor, he said, I pray that I last. I said, why do you say so? The wife was there. The wife, he said, I am losing my joy every day. He told me how his sub master, seven years, they settled him, he started market, out of nothing, he struggled and made money. And as he was making the money, he was helping off the whole extended family member. And some of them, as he's helping them, they get bad mouth. He never sees some people. You give them food. They go say this one way, you give them big food today. Who knows who sent you? You not give them, they go say, hey, wicked man. Talk to me. This is another level of wicked. You will sit down like this. You, you will know whether you ask us, say, bless me, or he should no longer bless me. The man told me, he built a house for some of them, he trained some of them for school. But do you know where they, he said they have been doing that rubbish, saying it, he never take it serious. But at the time, they confused his own mother through one of his own brother who didn't succeed in life. You are a smoker. You are, you the smoking what they walk up and down. Now you define who hold your star. <laughs> and they said, now one pastor tell and say, now your brother, now you they use your star. You, the star market, you know they stay. They give you work, you go resign. They not only go be a ball, go here, you go smoke. Ah. Oh my God. That one came back to confuse their mama. So that year, the man came back for Christmas. Bought things for the mother. Brought all he's supposed to do. Before the whole very eye of the whole family, mama say, Oh, go, go. That's ritualist and no job. That one they do like this, they won because fire away is set. Mama won and say, This is your money, no give me. I don't want chop, I don't want that. Because they say they look for head when one day renew the money again. Jesus Christ. Let God arise and his enemy be scattered. Let God arise and his enemy be scattered. Let God arise and his enemy be scattered. Oh Lord, my God, arise. The man was crying. He said, Me who served master seven years after serving a heart in God. He told me one of his own brother that two of them went to boy boy at the same time. That one did not stay. He said, oh God, they treat him. That one came back. He refused to serve. Go another place, come back. It was he himself who finished when he started market, gave him some money to start. That one now is doing well. He said, they don't see all this one. That one, he said, they use his star. He said, see who I want to use his star. My own star, where did he not go? You never see something for family. You go even see something where they say they use their side. You go ask whether they guess there at all. I'm telling you, just because they want to enjoy you. I know people do wickedness, but what I'm trying to say is that say what is not real. Now let me tell you. Such thing, if you want to defend yourself, you kill yourself. That's the danger of that battle. If you say make I use my mouth, no, silent is the best answer for a fool. Barandi Romumbae or Barachine Alanile and Ebumo keep on the Guru. You never know some people, there are some people in the family who are stingy. If you call them stingy, they say yes, they want to be stingy. Then to help you finish, carry bad name. The man was sharing tears. He said, Everybody have been saying it. Until his own mother. He said that was when he said you have to call the wife and the children, they return back to the city. Say no more Christmas. The mama said, This is your ritualist money. No, they give me. If not me, they send. May you get. And I asked Mama, for more than 20 years, I've been taking care of you. I never take your hair. 
You go sick, I carry go hospital, run up and down, build your house. Only, I'm not the first son, but I'm carrying the load of the first son, carrying everybody. Now, now, Mama say, you know, one job, may leave a man hunger, the killer. Oh, hey! I decree upon somebody there may God intervene for you. Amen. Now, hear me. Every enemy they have paid to rubbish your glory. Any man or woman anywhere they have paid to blackmail you with your picture. Somebody rise or run fire, trader. Fire, fire, fire. Whoever that is lying to confuse people to hate you. I decree in this service they will carry their load. In the name of Jesus, they will carry their load. Am I talking to somebody here? Let me tell you, the worst thing that can happen to you, no matter who you are, is to be a carrying them that is not yours. What you don't know, they say not you. And not just they say, the people believe. You look yourself like this. You say, God, why? Iboni bembe ariye, ese be ariya, ibe bere nasu, oni bembe ariya. Hakane bara be ariya, ibe bere nasu, oni bembe ariye, ese be ariya, ibe bere nasu, oni bembe ariya. Now, this morning, look, I am hearing something in my spirit. Anybody here that they carry your picture going in the wrong place? Anybody here they are using your picture to do evil? Somebody run fire three times. Fire, fire, fire. One of my son in the law came one day. He said, about their market. Somebody called him and said, he said, put me for waiting that they do. I get married. I said, what do you mean? He said, no. He said, no company. Make a call the look. Team Nivan, I get hurt. He said, we're well, looking at the young man. He came to his office. He said, I don't understand. He said, no. He said, no, pretend. We know, say, where are you there strong? Put me. Did they hear? He said, call him, say, I don't know what you are saying. If you want help, let me take it to my pastor. He said, pastor, pastor, pray and I ain't make you like this. He said, boy, tell us true. Never hear some desperate enemy. He said, he told him, he said, I used to go to church. Oh. Even I have paid 20 times to go for mountain for my church. I have paid for special meeting for my pastor. Now he said, he told him, he said, I don't need, I don't pay. In our own church, we don't pay. If you want me, I will bring you. Let him put hand on your head. He said, just like that. He said, I'm sure, bro, you know, they deceive me, they deceive me so. He said, now he tell him, are you sabi? If that did not make you happy. Ah. He came to tell you what they are thinking. You say you will carry my Lord. You say you will be my God. Oh Lord. I, I am in your presence. To have my own portion. This morning I'm declaring any name that is not your own. They are calling in that market, in that office, in that house. May God vindicate you. May God stand in for you. In the name of Jesus. Bear it in mind. Even within your family, there are many who don't want to see you standing. And any day you stand, get ready for another blow. Now, there was one mama I prayed for in this city. It's not a remind, but somebody brought her. This mama had children, but the children left her. When I mean the children, the rich children who God has blessed, who's supposed to take care of her, let her. Because they are not hearing some rumor from the family 
said your mama na witch. And this woman had been serving God right from time. So, and there were some people. Hey, let me tell you, they might, there's level of wickedness. Here. Now the one way you see, now you go talk. So at the time, they had to do some kind of manipulation. Somebody was like confessing that woman to be a witch. You never know witchcraft get different level. <laughs> it gets some way beyond mama witch, some they they, they witch. They, they use walking stick, they, they walk up out to me. And when the thing came up in this city, you know how it looked like. The children, two children where they are brought, they are supposed to be taking care of their mother. And it was the woman who carried them go abroad, who helped with the little thing he was doing. And they, as God may help her, and the children also, they gathered. Two now went to abroad. The first daughter, who promised them, mama said, if God bless me, I will not leave you. I will make you proud. Because they came from polygamous home. And at a time, four or five years, that one doesn't call the mother. Any number he used to call any of the siblings, and the mother called that number, he would change the number. And he was the one feeding the mama, paying the rent. At the time, he had abandoned her. Thank God for the one that is in Benin here, who was taking care of her. Mama de Kra. Old woman, at that time, above 60, they shed tears. Who do me this thing? He said, How can I have children? Who's supposed to be taking care of me? And now I'm begging for food. So when he came, I placed some prayer. Anybody who, no, what happened was that, no, sorry, see what happened. The children started dreaming, seeing their mama face. They torment them abroad. That was what happened. And it was those people in the family who believe, say, oh, you don't train your children, you they go to church, you want better pastors, we will show you another one. The children, all of them begin to see their mama in a negative way. If they pray finish, now the mama face they see. Now if now you. <laughs> they left the mother. Mama was crying. Thank God for the one here. That one said, no. I don't believe it. I will stand with my mother. That was the only one. Others disconnected. And the one that disconnected was the one who was supposed to take good care of their mother. So when we started the prayer, Lord, whoever that is using my face to do evil in the spirit. Oh, you never know. You know, Bible called witchcraft. Another name for witchcraft is familiar spirit. Why is it familiar? It can use the face of anybody. Go walk. You go borrow face, come, but not be the real face. No matter how you pray, not the same face. But especially when that person is their target. There was one day in this hour, I say, you must put hand on your face, pray, that this my face is not good for witchcraft. Anybody that wants to borrow my face in any covenant, in any kingdom, can I hear fire three times? So that was what was happening. Everybody in the family, they complain the woman. Naim, Naim, he bought his the own children. Mama, they cry. So when they, they came, I called her and said, Whoever that is using your face just to punish you and frustrate you, that you walk finish, you can't even eat. So she, the old woman did the prayer. Seven days fasted more than she. The mama said, even though I die for this fasting, it's better. Just like Esther said, if I perish, I perish. So when he finished, he and the daughter came. They put a the seed on the altar. I said, Lord, prove the truth. If this woman is guilty, expose her. If she's free, fight for her. That's why we left the prayer. After three weeks, a small girl in the family house began to confess. Come here, confession. If they confess, they piss somebody. Like, where did they flog person for ground? And you don't know that you see where did they flog picking for ground. 12 years ago. If they confess, they roll herself for ground. They piss, they poop, they talk, people gather. And that was where he mentioned, he said, Now, so so go and say, because he put you for face, we go show and say, There's levels. So they, they borrow the woman's face. They can they torment the children so that they will abandon their mama. That's to say, the children will make the money, but she'll be begging for food. As they were talking, somebody was recording it. God, the children have run, left their mother. When they called, the woman went to market, they called her, she came back home, held by herself. The elder in the family, the eldest man, held the whole thing, and they knew that they had children. Because even many times, 
the mama has complained to the family. The children say, no, they are no more the children. They have disconnected. So they said that we are using the woman's face. Anyone who won't walk under the woman's face to make sure that everybody in the family, both within her children, outside her children, they will begin to complain of her. And at the time, nobody they near her. Helu ne la kamo, helu na la le la kamo, akamo de kwa mocha. Did I make it today? Who are carrying what is not their own? And I don't know where you are hearing me, but God will enter your battle. Whoever that is using your picture, using your name, whoever that is bearing witness of what you are not, I put my nail on the altar. If what they said is true, may God help them prove it. But if it's lie, they will poop for body. They will be alive, they will be smelling dead. Can I hear that they may treat high? Let me show you something. Do you know, have you read Psalm 139 from 21 to 24? Look at what David said. At the time, they were even fighting him. He saw people he called, begin to see him as a problem. Look at what David said. He said, do not I hate them, O Lord, that I hate thee. Am I not grieved with those that rise against thee? Verse 22. He said, I hate them with what? Perfect hatred. I count them my enemies. Because whatever you don't love, I don't associate. I'm a child of God from my heart, not from my lips. David said, now, read, look at 23. What did he say? He said, Lord, search me, oh God, and know my heart. If I had my heart for people, I can't hide it for you. He said, I might and he said, and try me and know my thought. If my heart is evil, if I have think evil, if I have participated, if I've gone to a place that I'm not supposed to. Because at that time, most of his friends started leaving him. The battle of Ahitophel was not a small one. People who loved David detached. His best friend turned towards the enemy. The Bible said that Absalom stole the heart of men. There are some kind of information people will give out. The enemy will use it to steal the heart of your helpers. That those who love you, they will say, they say, leave that one a pretender. Give up a pan where be cole no mania. Give up my mamma be catch a bolamo. That mama was selling. When that girl confessed, finished. It was the elder in the family who called the daughter in Europe. He said, Please, you, you people need to apologize to your mother. The man said, Why? He said, No, no. He said, He listened. I'm the one talking. He said, because if your mother died tomorrow, we'll punish all of you. Because you are the one that killed her. He said, in, the old man now was telling the daughter what happened. And the, the daughter called another person of family. They said, no, be smart. They said, we are wearing the, your mother's face to torment, travel abroad to torment. Just for you to abandon your mother. Just for your love to die. He said, enemy. Chuku bilio, Omega bilio, Chuku bilio, bilie kaba. Do you know there are some problems at times you begin to ask God, God is still there. God, who do evil? No, say do evil. If they call him evil, he will not shake because he know that's exactly his name. But you, you say you, you, you look at yourself, you never know the opportunity not. You never do it before, but somebody is bearing witness. Because they paid him. But hear me. Watch this. Look at what I want to tell you in, the, in my conclusion. If you are going through such, don't ever use your mouth to defend yourself. Use your knee. Let him judge. Now God will. If God didn't answer for you, you can't answer for yourself. They say, hey, we saw you. So they, somebody will say, no, you. So you follow them, join the place. No talk. Clear conscience. Fears no accusation. Don't ever use your mouth. Use your knee. Because most times when you want to explain, you will spoil it. 
I'm telling you. Too. Got that woman? Refused to talk. They say, hey, why are you not talking now? He should explain things to us. What do you want to explain? Now watch this. I'm going to pray a dangerous prayer in this house. If anybody has put your picture anywhere for evil or to blackmail you, if there's anybody who they have paid, who they have said, hey, because we couldn't stop him, let's black, let's spoil that blessing in his hand. This one I pray. If they are true, then what they are saying about it is true, they'll go free. But if it's not true, hear this. Do you know the way I'm led to pray? They will not die like that. They go their life. There was something that happened somewhere in one community. A woman who did such evil, but at the time God visited her. If you see her punishment. There's something people people call or didn't do a You are alive. Person is alive, but who died better pass? He go poop like this. He go take on the road. <laughs> At a time, the children they pray make death come. Death was far. He just they are alive, they useless. Because the end of the week, the Bible says it to be ill, it to be punishment. Hear what they said. To any of you hearing me, it's true. May God judge in the heart. But if it's not true, those who brought out this evil information, they will be alive. A dead man will be better than them. In the name of Jesus, they will go through punishment. They will not die in a hurry. They will be calling death, and death will be far. Lift up your voice, shout them, and treat her. Go back to that Psalm 139, verse 24. Sit down. I want to look at my conclusion. We want to pray now. David said, and see if there be any wicked in, in wicked way in me. And let me in everlasting. That's who said, if I, my hands are not clean, punish me. Hold them one hesitate the most I call me a potam on a dom name it so ya no be it's a not in the world yes him yes him yes him not in no on your one is it terrible the most I call me a potam on a dom name it so ya no be they say not in the world. Yes, him. Yes, him. Yes, him. Not in the world. I said some things. Then after that prayer, when they called the lady, the lady had to come emergency. Shame didn't let her to call the mother again. When he came in this city, he went somewhere, bought a house, two, two flats, fenced it, maintained it, filled it with property. Exactly what he promised the mama before. Because God has blessed her. And he came to the mother's house. Saw the mother. The mother said, no, I don't need you again. You have abandoned me for close to seven years. If I have died, where will you come and call me mother? If I have been in the grave today. And the mama asked, if I hear such thing from somebody against you, and I did not verify, I take side immediately. What will you say? He said, mama, no mistake. Now, which did they do all those things? People who are supposed to stand for you, they won't stand for you. I decree. Whoever that is there to disconnect men from you, at the stand of your enemy, may God frustrate them. Yes, am, I, am I talking? Yes, if the enemy wants to wicked you, they will disconnect helpers from you. People that love you, that believe that without you, at the time you see them, they will tell you, say, we can do without you. I'm telling you, there are some people today, they are alive. It look as if they are not existing. All the people that used to know them, nobody knows them again. Because somebody has detached them. It's another level of wickedness. And if they say such thing, and at the time the man no get, or the woman, they go say, we're not talking. Oh, we go. They are the one who did the thing. But hear me. One thing I've seen in my life, God told me, he said, check the wicked. No one is happy. He said, they are the one doing evil. They are the one drying. 
Stretch your hand towards me. Whoever that is calling you name that is not yours. And now many have agreed to their voice. At the sound of your amen, God will give them load. One day, somebody called me. I prayed. Mama was laughing by the side. I said, why are you laughing? He said, that prayer point is funny. What did I pray? I said, don't worry. God will give them load that is bigger than their head. That's my prayer. May God put like two bungalows on their head. Lord, they look like two flats. What will happen to their neck? If you raise your hand, say amen. It will be so. Anybody who have hand over your problem, shout the Father. Any man tormenting my destiny, any man tormenting my family, in the name of Jesus, die. Now we pray. Now look at the second prayer. We want to balance this prayer. If what they called me, I am. Lord, judge me. That's what David said. Though. He said, Search me. Go back to that scripture from verse 21, Psalm 139. That scripture, very strong. He said, Okay, put it to 22. He said, I hate them with perfect hatred. I calm them my enemy. Then verse 23, he said, say, Lord, search me. Now, do you know why he means he used the word search me? Because at times some people can hide their evil. Pretend that they don't know about me why they are guilty. That's why David said, Lord, search me. I am open to you. If what they are saying, I am guilty. He said, judge me. But if my eyes are clean, he said, give them punishment that they deserve. Yeah. And that's the prayer I wanted to pray. Lord, don't say, some of you can say, nobody have thought, let me tell you, no matter who you are, God bless you, people no go talk. Now lie. That's to say, God never bless you. Oh, you didn't hear me. I, am I talking this? I'm, ta I'm talking to mature people. When I mean blessing, nobody say you get bread and a, a tea to drink. No. That God bless you, visible blessing. They are threatening enemy. Say everybody go like you. <laughs> you are joking. They go tell you the call to belong. Am, am I talking? Watch now. Go, go and listen. I'm, I'm telling you true. You succeed in life. They will tell you how you succeed. If you still fail, they're not going to talk saying I didn't hold you. They're not going to say they know you're waiting to hold you. They're going to say that you know yourself. So the prayer will pray now. If there have been any wrong information about me, oh Lord, search me. If I am guilty, judge me. But if I'm innocent, return the Lord to my head, pursue us. Open your mouth and turn it to prayer. Pray the prayer. Lord, if I am guilty, judge me. You are a just God. No man can bribe you. But if I am innocent, those who are behind this earth, let sorrow not finish in their heart. They will be crying in the sleep. They will cry in the day. They will be alive calling death and death will be far from them. Because they have taught the Lord's anointed. Allah, da, 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 da. Where is the Lord God of Remai? Where is the Lord God of Remai? Where is that God that has survived? Oh, she 
In Jesus' name we pray. Do you know one thing that brings me in life? The wicked also want to have peace. Oh, you didn't hear me. The wicked, they want to enjoy peace. But Bible said there is no peace for what? The wicked. I want to pray one. I want past decree. God revealed this to me. I don't know who I'm talking to. I use myself reaching you. Whoever that have bear any witness against you. In the land, in the sea, in the air. If what they said is truth, may heaven prove it. But if it's lie, may earth reject them. Some of you today, God bless your children. They have called your children names. Just to make you not to even be happy that God remembered your children. You are the one carrying your family now because they didn't like, they are not surprised how you did, others didn't make it and only you. Let me tell you, every genuine human being that has sense is praying God. Even though all of us are not rich, raise somebody. Joseph was the only one among the twelve who was governor and he carried others. Something happened here some time ago. I was ministering. A, a woman called, keep telling me something strange. I had to remove my microphone. I called her. I said, Mama, how is your head? He said, I'm, I'm not okay at all. I said, that's what God said. But God told me, you are the brain behind your problem. I didn't want to use my microphone because I don't want to create a problem anywhere. He said, why do you say so? I told her, I said, did you be a false witness against anybody? Anytime, any day in your life. But I asked her, I said, this sickness have lasted how long? He said, seven years. There's no hospital, they have not taken her. And yet, she can't sleep. She can't find peace. They didn't find anything. No peace at all. He told me, said, even that as she's inside service, on that farm, he was sitting somewhere, he said the farm, no, the entire body. He see the sweat. He's as serious as that. Even when you under AC, put it to the highest, you could sweat. Because he said, this one a real punishment. And you hearing me there? If you are a wicked man or woman, repent. Oh. You put her for evil. No matter evil he is evil. Some use their mouth, they do their own. Some use juju, they do their own. But the wicked cannot go unpunished. I want to pass the here. I know I'm connecting the whole world here. When I finish this prayer, those who are guilty will know. And those who put her for evil, they pay them 10,000 they want. They, 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 they sold their hearts for evil. Oh. Now hear this. So the woman do like this. He said, tell your God now. Nah, look, you forgive me. I don't suffer. I know they sleep. And everything. Sit down. Let me talk this. Then we'll pray. I said, God will forgive you. But if you confess. Sisters and brothers, what happened? I'm standing on your in this house. When the brother wanted to marry, who is the breadwinner of the family? Who has money? Helping all of them. When he wanted to marry, he said there was a lady she, he was seen, he wanted to introduce the brother. The brother said no. And he, she herself and the brother were so close. You know, when you come to family, there are people, they are five and six, the same mother. And anything about them, you can't bring. In fact, they are good to each other. What this one cannot get from him, no other person can get it. Am I correct? He said they were that close that anything she demands, even while she's married, he has helped the husband buy the husband car. He said, but when he gets to marriage, the brother, no one here again. He said he now was suspecting that the lady used charm. He said, this is not my brother. The way he loves me. Hear my word. Eh? If he loves you, he will marry you. So the brother insisted and told him, and one hand said, if you want our relationship to continue, support my marriage. If you don't support my wife, I will see you as an enemy. So when he heard that statement, he had to pretend, follow the brother for the marriage. After the marriage, not up to one month. He said that time, they have not started registering SIM card. He went to buy one SIM card. Early morning, take fire call. When he knows the hot brother is still at home. When he called the woman on, he begin call the hot brother home. And when the woman pick, he said, where is this? He, he, was, he said, 
she now pretended as if he was calling the woman number without knowing that it was a husband he said now your customer the native daughter that gave you what you take marry your husband come pay me my money now come pay me your telling you. He said, the man said, I can't hear you. He said, yes now. What to say? that You don't marry now. You are enjoying the marriage. You don't want to pay me. He said, instead, I go spoil her more. And he cut the call. The man was shouting and he broke the SIM card through away. Then when the wife came back from the bedroom, came out from the bedroom, according to the man asked us, beat the woman for the first time. He said, so, no, it's not my real sense. Oh, my sister had been talking. I didn't listen. That early morning carried the load. Flew and called and said, It's over between us. And okay, you smoke best you own, right? And now you want peace. No, I'll pray this morning. Whoever that say you don't have peace, peace will finish in their house. Hey, hey. My lad, da, 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 da. Whoever that say good thing is not good in your life. Whoever that say is not happy that God is blessing you. That they want to put all life outside down. I turn their life outside down. May their evil catch up with them. May their sorrow catch up with them. Somebody had a fire. He said she broke the SIM card. Listen. Because she was confessing to me now. He said she broke the SIM card. And threw it away. And the brother came back to her. The following day or the same day. Said sister thank you. I never listened. I never knew that this woman is evil. That's why I didn't hear you upon how close we are. So they have to advise the brother now. She now advised the brother to remarry immediately. And the brother remarried another woman. And I asked her, I said, where, are they? where is that woman? He said, I don't know. She don't go continue her own life. Eh? Continue her own life. This is about seven years. Anyone who don't put tears for your eyes. Huh? This morning I'm angry in my spirit. If God has called me, he will prove it over somebody today. Hear me. Look at the one who prayed this way. If I am a man with genuine call of God, if the oil on my head is ripped from God, he will prove it to somebody. There is somebody there you are hearing me. I am angry in my spirit because God is showing me something. Anybody who put you in social media, blackmailing you just to kill the love of people towards you. Use your picture to forge lie. If God has called me, they will be alive crying for death. They will be alive crying for death. They will be alive crying for death. Sorrow will catch up with them. Tears become their portion. Somebody shall fire seven times. with me my God the devil I have if what they are saying is true let God prove it before 2020 is over but if they are just searching lies they will be alive calling for death my God the devil. father I challenge you by my call you told me recently that the call of my head is the voice of Elijah the whatever I say, you will carry it out. Lord, if truly you have called me, I bow my knee on this altar. Anyone they have blackmailed, anyone they have bear false witness, whether in your community, your father's house, in social media, in newspaper, in any direction, just to spoil your name, to kill your grace, to kill your happiness. Where is the Lord God of Remite? Where is the Lord God of Remite? Where is that God to answer my fire? If what they said is true, Lord, judge that enemy now. But if it's pure lie, they will be alive. They'll be begging for death. They will be alive and their life will be useless. In the night, they will be crying. Under the sun, they will be sharing tears. In the pour water to body to become a seed. In the name of God the Father, Son and the Holy Ghost, from now to the verse, Anyone that will use your number for evil, use your picture for evil, use any of your team for evil, may sorrow catch up with them. May they die a miserable death. Where is the Lord God of Rema? Where is the Lord God of Rema? Where is that God answer my fire? Judge them in a hurry. 
Charge them in a hurry. Charge them in a hurry. In the name of Jesus. Rise or say amen ten times. testimony about what I'm praying today. If God has called me, if there's a new oil on my head, I provoke heaven. Every man or woman under my the sound of my voice, they have gone through this kind of wickedness. And the people who are doing it, they are celebrating because they have succeeded. No. An invisible hand will flog them. They will enter sun. It will look like pepper. They will pour water to their body. It will be like acid. When they take the breath, it will look as if they drink kai kai. They will be alive begging for death to kill them. And death will be far from them. In the name of Jesus. I went to a community. A man called me. He said, Pastor, he said, answer. He said, help us, please. Help us. He called me one corner. I thought he wanted to say something serious. He said, my mama, if they die, no greed die, finish. Please, come help us pray, make it die, finish. Not land like this. He said, he said, God, they answer you. He was serious. He said, we don't suffer. He said, they are like they smell. You know, greed die. He died, finish, go wake up. I said, why did it happen like that? He said, they say, my mama put her for evil. He go tie his head. Now, the children, they beg for death. <laughs> he said, now, powder, they, they rub and go find some of those powder where they sent. The rubber man will You can't wake him up. You know if you wait. He said today you go, you don't die. In the next two hours. Now punishment. They hope people don't run. He dare alive. He said, make a company, make a die. I said, alive. Now your mama, you know, go die like that. He they asked me, God, if I don't want to. I said, no, no. He said, this one alive. I said, no, no. Now your mama. I don't want to pull half another person load. You carry your load. Owners of evil load. Sit and give the Lord a clap. Are, are you with me? I am waiting to hear. Body in that office, wherever. Whoever that have bear false witness. Because it's against the commandment of God. Whether in social media, they bear witness. Just to spoil the little thing in your hand. God will fix it there. Hear what they are saying is true. God will judge who is guilty. But if they just set and enter them. Now that woman, how did that end her matter? After she confessed, finish. He said, she prayed for her. I said, I'm not going to pray for you. He said, what your advisor? I said, in fact, before he share grace, leave this up. Before he spoil the anointing in this up. I'm telling you, too, that's what my spirit told me. It's okay, what I do? I said, go on for that woman. Now she go deliver you. That woman, now if you ask some mercy, and that's the truth, if she forgive you, put her hand on your head. But if she not forgive you, <laughs> he said, God, no, he, he said, don't confess. And I say, no, be me, you're supposed to confess. God tell the mama. He said, I know your idea. No, no, you go look for her. You are happy now, say your brother, no marry her, right? And now Koboko don't come. You want to dodge your hair. You didn't say, God, no, they see. And that woman, go and check. She's a dangerous woman. He's a covenant daughter. Who know the mountain where she don't go? Go cry. Ah! And me, I don't even know whether I'm pray for that. Hey, you, now you understand. I don't even know Nami deliver. Nami one comes for the end. No, you go look for her. Allah said, before I share grace, carry your shoe. You are not needed here. <laughs> this year, your enemy will cry out. <laughs> <laughs> 